Don't feel bad if you can't follow it, because I'm basically speaking another language now. I like the idea of linear regression feeling less mysterious and feeling decidedly unsexy almost, where AI is just matrix multiplication. And what do you mean just? <laughs> How much math do people really need to get started with ML? There's different notions of prerequisite, though. That's like, you, st you, you need to know the definition of a gradient before you can do this. Like, no, you don't. You just learned it on the fly. Like, just in the moment, someone tells you what it is, gives you a couple of yeah. examples, and you get it. And then the other one is a notion of, like, fluency with the way that we even do math and, like, do the manipulations and things like that. You don't have to, you don't have to do that ahead of time to get the high-level goal. And so it shouldn't be seen as, like, hey, make sure you take this calculus class before you even start to engage with machine learning. Don't feel bad if you can't follow it because I'm basically speaking another language now. And like, you might want to go and learn some of that yeah. language before engaging in the same way that you would want to know algebra just because it's it's part of the language that you're even using to write things symbolically to like rearrange your equations and all of that. It's not so much, hey, you're going to use every single fact from like a high school algebra two class. But broadly speaking, I think it's great to just learn on the fly as needed. And I think it's great to actually use these topics from ML as motivators for linear algebra, motivators for calculus, rather than saying, hey, before you can even engage with it, make sure that you've like walked Definitely. through the Pearl <laughs> Castle first. And you <laughs> clearly have great. a knack for explaining technical things yourself. And like, is that a place your mind has always gone to or a, a hobby you've always engaged I with? Appreciate, I appreciate that. Yeah, I think always loved like just helping like with other classmates in high school and, and undergrad. You mentioned linear regression. I actually think that's a great place to start. So I, I haven't made videos on linear regression, but if I was sitting down and rather than saying, what I want to do is explain what a neural network is. I said, what I want is like foundations of machine learning. I like the idea of linear regression feeling less mysterious and feeling decidedly unsexy almost where it, it, it grounds cool. it all such that rather than being this like black box, you're like, oh, I'm like fitting a line to data. You know, I was like, how would yeah. I fit a line to data? For something that's otherwise this big black box, it's kind of like, oh, it's not magic, right? It gives you that feeling that it's not magic. Yeah, it's like kind of like when people say, oh, AI is just matrix multiplication. I mean, it's a bit of an oversimplification, but at the same time, it's kind of true. <laughs> and what do you mean just? <laughs> that's a very expressive, <laughs> like super general thing to do. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, maybe what that highlights is like, what else did you think it could be other than like multiplying numbers and adding them together?